Hi, welcome back to Hacienda Homestead. Today I have a different sort of video. This is going to be short, but I know that I am not a creative person. I have a hard time decorating and we have been living in this house for a little over a year and I feel like it's, it's, it's not warm. It's not cozy. And so I was going to show y'all my kitchen, my living room, my dining room, and I want y'all's opinion on what I should do. I'm going to tell you what I was thinking of doing, but I've not done anything yet. I am planning on doing something this summer and I need help because it's just not in me. Like I can't, I know what I like, but I don't know how to get it there. So I'm going to turn y'all around and show y'all my living room. So this is my living room. Uh, this wall right here is a light, light gray and everything else is white. <clears throat> my rug. So it's pretty plain. There's not a lot to it. On this side, we have a big entertainment center on this wall. Um, I am going for the farmhouse look. I don't know. I'm, it's not there yet, though. I know that. <clears throat> Piano. This is a little area over here uh, with some toys and things for my nieces. So, this is, I'm going to go ahead and point out, this is our main coon, Estes. And this is our Siamese Pearl. So they are our two inside cats. So from our living room, there's the kitchen. Now, don't judge my kitchen. But I wanted to show you, I do have black cabinets with the hardware is gold. And my countertops are like a swirl of white, black, brown, gray, all those colors. I do know that I, well, I say, I think that I want to paint my my cabinets white um so i want your opinion on that this is our fireplace so this is what i'm doing i am thinking about all of the trim in this house let me see we have some dark cross beams there but all of them are this color this dark color the doors um all the trim and let me show you the baseboards so the baseboards here they're all dark <clears throat> and so what i'm thinking about doing is painting all of the trim and the baseboards everything white and then going back in and painting a lighter color on the walls, like maybe a cream color. So my first question would be on this fireplace, do I need, if I do that, if y'all think that's a great idea, should I replace the, the grates, the front part of the fireplace, the doors and stuff with a lighter color? Should, should I leave it, leave that the same? Because right now I think it looks good with the dark, let me back up. It looks good with the dark trim. But I don't know if I turn, if I paint it white, if that's going to need some sprucing up also. So that's my first question. Second, would you paint the cabinets white or would you leave them? Would you paint the trim white? And then here's my dining room. My dining room is, is not decorated to the best of its ability because well like I said I don't know so I've done this little thing over here um we have a little black hutch there we have a little hutch here with a coffee station and of course it does have the dark baseboards and crown molding and then this is an outdated um well i say it's outdated i don't guess it's outdated but it's for the doorbell this little thing right up there and this is front this is i do have a nice i do like my light fixture up there 
And so that's what we have going on. And then from this, from the dining room, this is the another way to get into the kitchen, as you can see, all the kitchen cabinets. It's a dark, it's a dark kitchen, and I'm not saying that I don't like it. I just think it would brighten things up if it was white. And so here are the cabinets. Um, <clears throat> an interesting fact about this house, I've not done much of anything as far as replacing anything, um, painting anything, but I will tell you, and I, I, I will tell you a quick story about this fireplace. When we moved into this house, this fireplace, well, actually, it was before we moved in. When we saw it, I immediately knew I was going to have to do something about this fireplace. Um, the fireplace was completely painted matte black, the same color as our kitchen cabinets. And I knew that that was going to have to change. So what we did was we put on a paint remover and then put saran wrap over that and we let it sit for uh, maybe two days. We draped plastic curtains uh, and kind of boxed it in. And my husband then power washed it while my brother and I each had a shop vac and we vacuumed up the water. And that is how we got most of it. Now, if you'll look, it's not perfect. Like I'll show you down here. You can still see. There you go. You can still see some of that black. I mean, it, it is far from perfect, but it, it looks tons better than what it did. And I'll insert a picture of what it looked like before we did this. And we, had the floors not been tile, we would not have been able to do that. I realized I did not press record when I was making the ending of the video. So it's the next day. I know this video was a little different than what I normally post, but I did want to get y'all's opinion. So please comment below and let me know your ideas. I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time.